Now, if you have watched any of my culture, Na culture fly videos, I keep wanting to say culture natural, like Scooby natural. This isn't that. You guys, it is here. It has finally arrived. That's right. The spring 2020 Supernatural box from Culture Fly. Seems like I've been waiting on this guy forever. If you follow my social medias, I'll have them popped up here on the screen so you can go check them out. But I've been waiting on this thing since April. April! But then shipping delays got put in effect. It is what it is. Nothing you can do. Got pushed out to May and then they were like, you know, we said May, but what we really meant was June. June came around I'm like, is it coming or not? And they were like, no girl. Here's your tracking. It's on its way. Now I know I'm uploading this video in July, but hey, life happens. I had some stuff that I needed to prioritize before I get back into the fun stuff. Now, all that being said, if you are new to the channel, welcome. I am Stacy. I have uploaded multiple Culture Fly unboxings, specifically the Supernatural ones on this channel in the past. Within the past month, I have uploaded the Friends and the Office box from Culture Fly as well. Had some requests for that, and I'll have those videos linked above and also a description bar down below. So whatever fandom you are, maybe I got it here for you. But you obviously are here for the Supernatural box, so let's dive into that one. <laughs> always your box is going to contain a card and this card is going to tell you what is inside your box. This box in particular contains nine items. All right, push you guys out a little bit because I wanted to show off the t-shirt a little better here. Now, if you have watched any of my culture, Na culture fly videos, I keep wanting to say culture natural, like Scooby natural. This isn't that. If you've seen any of my culture fly videos in the past, you know I am obsessed with the t-shirts. I love the quality. It is just mwah, superb. Absolutely brilliant. It has been consistent throughout all the years I have been purchasing these boxes and I am loving that. Hands down, one of the favorite things about this box is the t-shirts. Now, I have said in the past I get my t-shirts in a 2XL, personal preference. I don't like anything tight on me in the least and it just checks all the boxes for me. So that's the sizing I get. But when I opened the box and saw the design of the t-shirt, I'll be honest, I was a little let down. Now, I love the shirt, black and gold, phenomenal, superb colors to put together. It looks amazing. Don't get me wrong, I'm not talking negatively about the shirt, but we kind of seen this before. So here we have this one, it's Supernatural, it's just a black and white t-shirt, it's got the family business, saving people, hunting things. We got the wings, we got the eagle, we got the colt, we got the demon blade, we got the different sigils in the middle here. Now this t-shirt is three quarter sleeved, it is off white and navy, we got Sam Dean and the Impala in the background and we got again the motto of saving people, hunting things, the family business. So it's not a new concept because this one again says saving people hunting things, the family business. And I love, I love it. I love the shirt. It is absolutely brilliant, but I don't know. I was kind of hoping for something a little more. I don't know what that is, but there you have it. That's, that, that's just my opinion on this one now. Our next item up is something I've never received before in a box and it is a bandana. Here we have, we got a silhouette of Sam and Dean and Castiel. We got the logo of Supernatural Join the Hunt down at the bottom. And again, we have that black and gold motif that is very prevalent in this box. Uh, I don't know why I'm saying that. I'm looking at the other items. These are only two black and gold items. So where did that come from? Don't know. But anyway, I myself am not much of a bandana person. Um, maybe I could try using this as like a scarf in my hair or something i don't know i don't know i'm not much of a bandana person but i love the design i love the feel of it i mean it's super soft and silky so it's great quality but i just 
not sure where I'm gonna use a bandana at. Now our next item is again something that is never been given in a box up till now and it is a pair of shoelaces. It simply says Supernatural join the hunt over and over and over and over and over again and this is kind of neat. I mean it's something that not a lot of people think about. I personally don't have many shoes with laces but if I did yeah I would like to have this in there. Um, I actually have a pair of boots that maybe I'll change out the laces and they'll look really cool with this. But speaking, I forgot to mention about the shirt. It has the little Supernatural Join the Hunt logo. Now in that winter box that I was making, I remember talking about the shirts that over time they stopped putting that Supernatural Join the Hunt on the thing. Like this one had it at the top, Supernatural Join the Hunt. And in past t-shirts, it would be down at the bottom here. This one didn't have it anywhere whatsoever on it. And that's why I was like, well, maybe they were fading out of that, if you'll remember in that video, if you watched it. Um, I made the comment that they weren't putting that little emblem or whatever on there, but apparently they're just, you know, doing it on the sleeve like that now, instead of having the little patch type deal. And now it's emblazoned all over the shoestring. Supernatural joined the hunt. So, I don't know. It's a little inconsistent. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. I don't know what qualifies an item to get it or not, or if they just forget, or what happens, but sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. So, if that's something that bothers you, I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I don't know when to expect it. All right, check it out. We got another I was trying to think of what this thing was called. It's not a cup. It is a tumbler. That's the word. And if you'll remember in my friend's box that I done, that one had a little bit of a leakage issue. So, ba-bam, got a little bit of water in here. Uh, put that back up. No leaking. So, aces to that. Now, when we undo the thing, I don't know if you say it. It does come out a little bit, so apparently it requires you to know suck on it to get some water out. It's not gonna like just pour out into your face. So there's that. Uh, again, we got the Sam, Dean, and Castiel in the background. We got the Supernatural Join the Hunt logo at the bottom. So apparently. They went pretty heavy on, yeah, we want that on here in this box because literally I'm looking at everything and everything has it on it. So they did not forget it this time around. It is there. Another first here. I got a wallet. This one says driver picks the music, shotgun shuts his K Cole. It's got a little cassette design on the front. At the bottom, we got the Supernatural Join the Hunt logo. In the inside, we got it as well. On the inside, we got six little slots, and then we got our big uh, empty space in the middle there where you put your cash. But, you know, it's a little bit of a flex to it. It's kind of a cloth material. Uh, I think it said polyester. So, it's a nice little wallet here. Oh, you hear that? That's right. It's time for another charm. Here's a look at that charm in detail. I mean, for as tiny as it is, and them to get as detailed as this, that's pretty impressive. So here is our charm bracelet filled out. We got the pie charm, the Winchester Brothers. We got the first blade, the Mark of Cain. This one came with the charm bracelet, the anti-possession symbol. We got Castiel's wings, and we have the Impala. What I love about the charms is that they have been consistent in giving us those different materials. So as you'll notice, I do have them spaced out from the ironwork piece to a shiny ironwork, shiny, ironwork, shiny. You get the gist. But I love that they are continuing giving us those different metals. So it's, you know, it's got a different look to it. It's not all the same thing. Moving right along, we have our artwork for this one. And here we got Sam, Dean, Cass, and Jack. So if you're not called up and have no clue who Jack is, be prepared to find out who Jack is. Love him. He, I think he's a nice addition to the cast. I have enjoyed seeing where his 
character is going whenever they can finish up the final season. Well, I'm excited to see where the character of Jack goes, what they do with him. So I'm really pleased that they finally have included Jack in something. Now our next item, we're going to go a little dark. And what I mean by that is I'm going to turn the lights off so you can see it in all of its full glory. Alright, so as you saw, this guy lights up in the dark, emits a little bit of a red light that shines off on this. It is not that bright of a light, so worry not. But again, we got the supernatural join the hunt there. And again, we have the saving people hunting things, the family business down at the bottom. So again, it's just a little cute little table weight, whatchamacallit, light up doodad. Uh, this just pops, you know, right out. And then we have our lights there. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Now I saved this guy for last because it had the potential of being one of my favorite items. And why do you say the potential? Well, we've done, I've done showed you everything that was in this box. And the shirt was revolved around season 15. We had the little artwork that is obviously from the more recent seasons here. The little the tumbler doodad. It still shows Sam and Dean and Castiel er, older versions of themselves from the later seasons. So why are we putting young Sam and Dean on this item? It just doesn't make sense. It does not fit with the rest of the box, putting the young version of Sam and Dean on here when the rest of the items you used an older picture. <laughs> so I don't understand why young Sam and Dean are on this and not reflected in the rest of the box. However, picture aside, I mean, it's a good picture. Don't get me wrong. Great picture of the guys, but I just don't understand why it's the young version when we're using the older versions and all the other items in this box. But we have the two blocks here that have all the different numbers on it so you can put in what day it is. And then we have these three guys here that's got all the different months on them. So you can put whatever day and month it is. And have it on display with Sam and Dean. So I very much enjoy this. I just wish they use a different picture. That's all I'm saying. And that is our box complete. There were nine items in this guy that was definitely on the higher end of items you can receive. I think the limit is like seven to nine, so nine being the max, and that's what we received. I totally think the boxes are still worth the price point. I know I've said that every time, but it still holds true. Now, even though collectively overall, this wasn't my favorite box I ever received, I'll be honest. But that doesn't mean I didn't enjoy the items. It's just I know there are certain items in this box that I'm not going to use, the wallet being one. It's not that I don't like the wallet. I love the design of it. I just know I personally am not going to use it. So that's going to be a gift to a friend that's going to love it. And he'll use it. Absolutely. Why did you say it like that? Absolutely. <laughs> but there are items that I personally love. You know, the charm is a great addition. The little tumbler. Of course, who doesn't like a little tumbler? The uh, little calendar guy, even though I wish they would have used an older picture instead of the younger one, but hey, I digress. You let me know what your favorite item was down in the comments below. Again, I wanna ask if you're not already, hit that subscribe button, give this video a like if you liked it. It's gonna help me out in the future. But I do have the summer versions coming soon. They should be shipping out this month uh, sometime in mid-July, I think, unless it gets postponed into August. I don't know. But anyway, they're coming, the summer versions of the Supernatural Box Friends and The Office. So stay tuned for that. Again, subscribe if you're not already. Hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when I do upload in the future because I know I'm a little sporadic right now. But hope you guys are staying safe. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.